finding 17.5% of these amounts without using a calculator, 17.5%. So let's write the first question. The first question is 17.5% of uh, 384.4 dollars for pounds okay so to find this uh, any percent is always a good starting point is to find 10 percent so 10 percent of this is one tenth of this which is 38.4 dollars or oh, sorry pounds I keep saying dollars so five percent if 10% is this, this will be half of this. So half of $38 is $19.2. And again, 2.5% is again half of this. So half of 19.5 is 9.5. Uh, half of 19 is 9.5. And then you got 0.1. So this is 9.6. Okay, so this is 15 and this is 17.5%. So that would be this much pounds. So 4 plus 2 is 6. Plus 6 is 12. Remainder 1, 9, 18, 27. Am I right? 2, 3, 2 plus 3, 5 plus 1, 6. 5 plus 1, 6, I uh, hopefully, 57.2 pounds. Okay, we'll check this on a calculator later. So B is, again, 17.5% of 238 pounds. So first, again, 10% is 23.8. So 10% is 23.8. So 5% is half of this. Half of 20 is 10. Half of 20 is 10. Half of 3 is 1.5. And half of 0.8 is 0.4. So this is 11.9. And again, half of 5% is 2.5%. So again, Half of 11 is 5.5, and half of 0.9 or 0.90 is 0.45. So this is 5.95. So this is 5.95. So you can put zeros here. These zeros are nothing but placeholders. So you can say 17.5%. This is how you do without a calculator. This is 5. 9 plus 9 is 18, plus 8 is 26. 2, remainder 5, 6, 9, 11, remainder 1, 2, 3, 4, 41.65. Okay, let me do one more. I would like you to do the remaining yourself. Okay, so let me change color. So the third question is 248. So 17. 0.5% of 248 pounds. So again, the same strategy. Uh, you can use different strategies here, but I think this is a very good strategy for 17.5. So 10% is 24.8 or 80. So 5% is half of this. That is pretty easy. This is 12.40. And so 2.5% is uh, half of 12 is 6, so 6.20. This was pretty easy. So 0, this is 8 plus 4 is 12, plus 2 is 14, remainder 1. Uh, 5 plus 2 is 7, plus 6 is 13, remainder 1, 2, 3, 4. So that is 43. Uh, 43.40 pounds. Let me finish it. So D is 451. So D, 17.5% of 451 pounds. So again, 10% is 
one tenth which is 45.10 so 5 percent is 40 i'll split 40 half of 40 is 20 half of 5 is 2.5 and half of 0 0.10 is 0.25 this will be pretty yeah, interesting so this is 22.75 so this is 22.75 and again half of 5 percent is 2.5 percent so now here yeah, this is 0 0.750 okay so half of 22 is 11 and half of 0 0.750 is this is 0 0 0 so 700 is 350 so 350 and 25 375 so this will be 0.375 so which is 11.375 11 11.375 11 and 25 which is 375 so the final answer so this is 5 5 plus 7 is 12 remainder 1 10, 11, 12, remainder 1, 5, 6, 8, 9, remainder 1, 4, 5, 7, 8, which is 89.225, which is nothing but 89, if you want in two decimal points, it's 2, 3 cents, 89.23 cents, and finally, it's 400 so that was pretty easy so let me change color so 10 percent of 400 is 40 5 percent is 20 and 2.5 percent is 10 which is 40 60 70 pounds so let us check this on a calculator okay so let's start from the very beginning so points uh, 1.7 17.5 is as a as a decimal is 0.175. So this is how I do menu run 0 0.1775 times 384. Just to check whether uh, yeah so here is a mistake. So 5 plus 1 6. So this is a mistake. So it's always good to check your answer. So I didn't check my answer, so this should be 67.5. So this was right, this was right, this was right. The only, for, I didn't add this one. Okay, so good, we checked our answer. For B, it is 0 0.175 times 238. Hopefully I'm right. 41.65, that's fine. For C, for C, I have to move this, uh, 0 0.175 times 248, which is 43.4, that was right. For D, for D, I'll have to move this here. This is D451, so 0 0.175 times 451. 79 I have made a mistake here okay so let's find the mistake what's the mistake that we did always good to check 41 22.75 this was right half of 11 is okay hopefully uh, 4578 uh 45.10 22 ah this is zero five okay so this should be zero five it's always good to check okay so i was in a rush this is zero point zero five because half of half of 22 uh half of 40 is 20 half of 5 is 2.5 and half of 0.1 is 0 0.05 
so this is 22.55 so if this is wrong this would also be wrong 22.55 so 22.55 so this would also be wrong that's why it's always good to check okay so this is half of 22 is 11 point zero zero and this is point five five so half of five hundred is two fifty two fifty and twenty five is uh, zero point two seven five so it's eleven point two seven five am I right so eleven point two seven five so let me delete this so again check it's always good to check so this is 5 5 plus 7 is 12 remainder 1 5 5 7 uh, 5 plus 2 7 8 9 point uh, so no remainder so 5 7 8 70 5 7 8 78 point yeah, 78.925. So one mistake carries forward to the next mistake. So hopefully this is right. This should not be wrong. So 0 0.175 times 400, which is 70.